Heba Abdelrazi comes from Egypt. She's worked in many countries. Now she's doing two years of research in molecular medicine at the University of Cologne. Here in, uh, in Cologne and in this lab especially, um, they are among the best, uh, not, only, not only in Europe but also in Germany. They produce a very high quality of viruses that are able to transfect my stem cells uh, with high purity and without any toxication to the cells. Abdel Razek is part of an international team whose working language is English. She's learning hardly any German here. That's a Balancing. good idea, actually. Mm -hmm. Yes, and this is another kind of tube because it has a conical mm. and it can stand alone without a rack. For T2, actually. But they are putting it on the rack thing. The University of Cologne provides extra personal support for foreign students. Language barriers and the unfamiliar customs often keep them from feeling comfortable in Germany. Only a few universities organize such programs, although integration is important for research. One of the great advantages of internationalization is the variety of viewpoints that enter into the research. There's a good reason why all successful research institutes, like those at Cologne University, take a strongly international approach. International exchange works though not always outside the university. Heba Abdelrazik, for example, has a hard time getting used to the reserved manner Germans often display. She looks for places that give her a feeling of being back home. She already knows one day she'll be returning to Egypt. A lot of reasons, not only, not only one reason, and the main issue is, uh, is that I want to be back with a family, especially with the situations in Egypt now. Plus, I'm not that happy also living alone. I'm single, so it's not, I'm not that happy living alone. Um, I'm not very much integrated in the German culture. I feel in the university that I'm, I'm a foreigner. Like Heba Abdelrazik, one in every ten scientists in Germany has a foreign passport. And much like her, many of them take their highly qualified knowledge back home with them after a few years.